Hi, I'm Miss Julie from Miss Julie's Kitchen. I garden, live, and work in the Summit Lake neighborhood. We don't receive deliveries of produce all the way from the other side of the country. We simply grow our own food and pick up the rest of what we need at the farmer's markets that we are already attending because we sell there. So I get to buy from my friends. We don't use any chemicals at the gardens whatsoever. We grow everything organically. At the kitchen, we also use compostable containers and we create reusable waste that we use for compost at the gardens. We have a big compost pile. And this past summer, we also built a thousand feet of fence around our gardens, a complement of the Neighborhood Partnership Program. And we used reclaimed fence and slightly bent posts, which saved us a ton of money and resulted in a super cool fence to help us keep out the deer and groundhogs, which are all over Summit Lake. We built it ourselves using the summer youth workers and our neighborhood workers. So take a look at what we've been growing all summer. This summer we are on Ira Avenue and she is now named Mama. Welcome to Mama, she is beautiful. Now these are the sun gold, these are acorn squashes. These I grew on purpose. Oh gosh, there's billions of them, yay. And this is no fertilizer, no bug spray, no Roundup, no nonsense hard work. Sweet corn. This hasn't made it to y'all because I pretty much just eat it raw because it's the bomb. Boom, look at that. <laughs> Don't you wish you could eat that? <laughs> okra, look at the okra flower. The most beautiful flower that you would never expect to find. And here comes Scott from the stew pot kitchen who's been up there raiding my basil patch. Show us your basil. Not quite half a pound, but man, there's so much there. There you go. What are you going to make? Tomato basil soup. There you go. Yeah. Vegan? Oh, yeah. OK, yeah, good. <laughs> I'm calling you out. Yeah. <laughs> you know I like dried beans. Sustainable protein, right? You can eat them all winter long. Lima beans, Dixie butter peas. Um, this is a new one to me. This is called a soldier bean. So you can see this is a green. And then this one here is preparing to dry. So let me open this guy up and show you why it's called a soldier bean. See the little soldier guy? Pretty cute, ain't he? <laughs> kind of looks like Batman. Two rows of beets, and we have picked hundreds and hundreds. <laughs> Funny carrot, green peppers. Planted 64 strawberry plants down here so that next summer we can pick our own. I probably ate three or four. It's kind of hard to keep the weeds out of these bad boys. And we gotta be quiet and careful because I'm not dressed to sneak up on bees. People say I have a green thumb, but really I just have friendly bees that love my plants along with me. Thanks for watching, how we bring you fresh, healthy food from farm to table.